Hello and welcome to another episode. Two brand new technical service bulletins have been released in the US for the Curie V9 last week. These are both drivetrain software updates. Whilst these can both be performed by your dealer, it's not clear yet if they will appear on the over-the-air updates. There is currently nothing listed on the OTA website yet. The first one is SA577. Details as follows. Service action VCMS Reserve Battery Charging Logic Improvement. This bulletin provides information to improve the vehicle charging management system or the VCMS operation logic on certain 2024 model year EV9s. Vehicles produced from September the 25th, 23 through to April the 1st, 24. The vehicle's high voltage battery or HVB can be scheduled to charge at a specific date or time using the scheduled charging feature. The affected vehicles might experience inoperable high voltage battery charging issues when the scheduled charging feature is enabled. Follow the procedure outlined in this publication to upgrade the VCMS software logic on the applicable vehicle. Before conducting the procedure, verify that the vehicle is included in the list of affected VINs. If this update becomes available outside of the US, then the update campaign number will be 240076. The second EV9 TSB released this week is SA558. It details as follows. Service action, RSPA logic improvement. That's the remote park assist by any of the name. This bulletin provides the procedure to update the software logic of the Advanced Driver's Assistance System, Parking, ADAS Park system on certain 2024 model year EV9 vehicles produced from September 24th, 23 through to November 30th, 23 to restore remote parking assist operation following incorrect software version installation, which may have resulted in RSPA becoming inoperative. Follow the procedure outlined in the publication to apply the improved logic to the ADAS Park system using the KTS ECU upgrade function in manual mode only, as described in this bulletin. For confirmation that the latest reflash has been applied to the vehicle you are working on, verify the ROM ID using the table on page 6 of this bulletin. If this update becomes available outside the US, then the campaign number will be 230138. As usual, I've updated my EV9 recall tracking spreadsheet. This contains a full list so far of all the updates applied to the EV9. The link to the spreadsheet is above. That's all for now. Thank you for watching.